When I bring on a new buyer client, one of the things I like to do is a ramp up meeting. We spend about 60 to 90 minutes talking through the whole process and what to expect. It's, a, it's really a valuable time together. One of the things I like to do as part of that is give a sense of not only where the emotional highs are and what the fun is in the process, which there is a lot of fun, but also where there are predictable emotional lows. First one, winner's curse. Very typical, especially in this market where we often have multiple bids and it's a competitive process. You go in, you're bidding against, let's say, three other people. Your bid is accepted. And then you wake up next morning with the horror and realization that you were willing to pay more for this property than any of the other suckers. And you start to doubt yourself. It's part of the process. The second emotional low I see is at and after the home inspection. So you love this house, you're paying a ton of money for it, and you go and hire an inspector whose only job is to tell you what's wrong with the property. And no one's gonna be talking about what wonderful light it gets and the wide pine floors. And instead, it's all focused on the nitty gritty of what's wrong, what needs to be fixed, what needs to be maintained. Uh, that can be a hard moment for some buyers. The last one, right before closing, actually. So you really, it's all culminating. You're about to get your house. And we go have a walkthrough of the property just before it closes. Now, probably every other time we've been in the property, it's been staged, there's been furniture, nice art on the walls. Now we walk in, it's empty. It looks like a ghost town. You see dust balls in the corner. There's no furniture. You see a stain on the floor where the carpet was. You see the uh, nail holes in the wall where the art was. Well, every room looks smaller without furniture in it. And you gasp and say, I I'm about to spend what on this? Um, and that's a moment and we get through that. So I say all of this to buyers to actually try to be reassuring that when they get to these points in the process where they're feeling a little bit low, they know this is normal. Everyone goes through this. This shouldn't shake your confidence. And we get you through it. And we get you to the happy time at the end when you're living in your beautiful new home.